Hello, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to some more Cosmic Terror. Uh, I am. <laughs> it, it's it's gotten out of hand again. Um, I I well, my my ships are doing better. Um, I'm starting to have some people problems. Um, but I have some ships. Um, and and I have I have I have some other ships. I I, I have I have other ships. <laughs> So those are kind of running with ghost crews, uh, somewhat uh, trying to. Uh, it, th this little purple one up here that I found it. It was just a wreck. It was just like chilling in the. Uh, it, it was just a, a like a question mark, and uh, I went and it, I just basically put people in it, and off it flew. Uh, so. Some of those I'm kind of, uh, you know, setting them over there until I figure out what I want to do with them. The little purple one, I, I like it. It's a cool looking ship, um, but the problem is, is it's just, it, it, it's not very good. Um, it, it doesn't have any rear thrusters on it. It doesn't. Uh, it's only got like two guns. Uh, oh, what are you screaming about now? One little piece of one little piece of work. All right, get the piece of ore then. Um, the uh, the stations, the, the stations I'll probably break down. Uh, a part of it was it was easier to grab the station and uh, bring the entire station back, uh, and then break it down later, uh, or uh, use that station as the the starting point to make something larger, uh, which I may do. Uh, some of these guys, these guys are kind of cool, um, but I did, I may have cheated a little bit, uh, and went and hung out in the, uh, so these are those, Steam Workshop, uh, there's the Rossinante, there's, a uh, another Rossinante, 48 crew, 112 crew, uh, and then, uh, Ship Hall. Uh, there's a couple of, of you know, classes shipped there. A bunch of stations uh, from Star Trek. Uh, so, I, I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I haven't quite figured that out. Uh, and, and trying to, oh, that's probably a bad thing. Are you guys get back in the ship. You guys are making a beeline for us. All right. Keep that there quickly, please. You also shoot that there quickly. You keep that there, and then you also shoot that. What gun does this thing have on it? Eh, I'm not really worried about those guns. Uh, and then I want you to go shoot that. All right, what is this? Uh, I probably don't want to worry about that. Either. All right, please blow those things up. Oh, that guy in the front just just caught a beating. Oh, it, it, it's not gone well for them. It uh, it has not it, it's it's not gone well. Uh oh, you need a repair. Okay, uh, it, that's that's a match repair. I I don't know if I will ever financially recover from it. Um, no repair for you. No repair for you. Oh, look, no repair for you either. Look, it's all worked out. A little bit of time to pick up some, some more, more gear. Uh, let's see, did, did I actually, oh yeah, I cleared it. All right, good. Um, I, so there was two stations. There was a station down here. There was a station up here. I cleared both of those. 
Um, let me pick you. Go up there. And then come back. What's what's at the question mark? Sulfur asteroid. Don't really need sulfur yet. Um, I'm debating on whether I want to go guns or stay stay with lasers. I like lasers, uh, but especially with ooh, uranium. Uh, part of the thing with uh, with the guns, it's less power. Uh, the rail guns have a much a much longer range. Uh, so, and they're a lot more destructive. Uh, you can, you can cause a lot of, a lot of damage with a rail gun. Um, so it's, yeah, I, I'm, I'm not sure exactly how I want to do it yet. I'm still, still kind of toying with the idea of, you know, which direction to go. Uh, and mostly just kind of playing, playing to have fun myself and, uh, just, just seeing what we can do. But uh, so far, I'm having a lot more fun with the game than I did probably when I first played through. Uh, I kind of ran into some issues. Uh, I, I, I Keeping the smaller ships uh, is, is greatly helped the ability to, to have a little bit more fun this time. So we'll, uh, we'll get these guys here, get them cleaned up. Go ahead and get all that stuff in. And we'll grab all these guys. Hey, could you get back in the ship? That'd be good. Yep, you. We're talking to you. That's fine. All right. Uh, so there's that. So there's that. That guy's done. Uh, let's go. A fugitive bounty. Let's go down there. So the big ship is still really slow. Uh, I need to get some stuff open. I probably need to go in and just buy all the research stuff that I need. Uh, and I'll probably just buy everything. Uh, in the grand scheme of things, it's easier just to buy everything and then not have to worry about it later and then be able to, to build it. All right, so we're going to take from is oh, okay, oh, it does do that. All right, good. <laughs> this guy's in for trouble, he just doesn't know it yet. Oh, he fell off my radar. That wasn't very nice of him. There he is. We'll get a little closer. Get the oh, it's a bounty. Uh, oh, there's three of them so far. Oh, four of them. Oh, this is this is escalated quickly. All right. Well, this is fixing to go badly for you guys. Did did the pirate shoot the other pirate? All right. Can we? Oh, okay. This is gonna go badly for you. Oh, your buddy's shooting you in the back, dude. That sucks. All right. Uh, yeah, this guy is, he's kind of scary. I actually have a cutthroat that I actually, that I, uh, uh, liberated. Chimney slug? What are you guys? Uh, four standard cannons? I, I don't, I don't, I don't like the looks of that. Yep. Just run into that for a minute. That'll be fine. You got three of them pound pound in the back, trying to uh, get to his. Dude, that guy, that guy took a beat. Why are you guys? I want you to do this. All right, there you go. Now I'll do this guy, and then I'll do this and go get all that stuff. We'll do that. 
Uh, you can repair yourself. Then repair him. And then repair that guy. Uh, you guys may want to put the fires out. Okay, maybe you weren't on fire. But if you weren't on fire, yeah, yeah, that we, we took some beatings. And these ships, they're they're all fairly small. They don't have um, they they don't have uh, uh I want to cancel the blueprint of that guy. This guy might um, I was going to try to change it into the other guy, but I figured eh, probably in the long run, uh, what I may do is uh, uh, let's see, let's go look at this and go their ship editor. Um, I may uh, steamship the Rust and Arte here. Uh, that's a 48 crew. I wish, I wish you could because I don't think you can click it. If I click on it, I think it's going to try to put it in place and start building this thing. Um, but what I may do is try to build like two of these and have those as my as my uh, wingmen, um, and then have like a, a a ship, you know, a manufacturing repair ship. So have the two those two gunboats basically go in. Uh, I, I'll probably have to build one to see if I even like it uh, because. The problem with this game and stuff on on Steam and stuff is a lot of the pictures aren't really they, they don't do the the items justice, um, so it, it makes it kind of difficult to figure out if you want the ship or not. You kind of have to download it, put it in, and then go. No, no, this is garbage. Um, and unfortunately, it's just kind of, I don't know. Uh, I don't know if there's a better way to do it. Uh, and I don't, I'm don't. i afraid if I click on that now, it's going to start trying to build it. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I, I don't want to do that. that. We all try it on that little purple ship. Because uh, if, I, if I replace a bunch of the little purple ship, I, I won't get out. I'm probably going to discard that thing anyway. Uh, it, it's, it's not bad. Um, but it, it's, it's not good. Uh, so, uh, this is, it, it's, it's just got like two, two little laser guys on the front, you know, it didn't even have any reverse guns. Uh, it only holds four crew, uh, our, our six crew total. Uh, so it doesn't even really, it's not that big. Uh, and, and then it keeps running into things and like backing up wrong. Um, this is uh, the the cutthroat. I was using it to shuttle crew back and forth. Uh, I'm probably going to get rid of this one too. Uh, and then uh, this sh ship here, uh, it, it had uh, it, it's it's not bad, uh, but it's I'll probably just I'll probably just deconstruct it also. Um, I probably should just sell all the stuff that's on this thing. Uh, I'm going to keep the ore because I can turn the ore into plates. Uh, and I originally was keeping the gun, the ammo, but we'll just sell the ammo. Uh, that way I have to sell it later. We'll sell all that. We don't, we don't need it. We don't need it. All right. But yeah, so that's kind of the stuff I've been finding. Uh, and like these guys, I, I like the the angled ships better. I don't know. I just for some reason I just like the angled ship better. Uh, I I just I don't know. It's different. It's you know it's a different aesthetic. It, it makes the ship look different. Uh, so I I do like that. I may I may try my hand at trying to build a an angled. Uh, Maybe maybe that's what I should start doing is uh, basically take one of these anglet uh, and basically have it be a manufacturing ship, um, but also uh, like make it a missile boat maybe. Uh, I that might be cool. 
Uh, so basically, have like two two gunships that uh, will escort it, and they basically go in and do everything, and have this thing just hang back and just unload missiles, and just cover cover the uh, the area with with the, the missiles. I kind of like that idea. What 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 small storage pod? Get some looks like it has some uranium and maybe some tristyl in it. Uh, it's just uh, titanium, some some uranium, refined uranium, and some uh, titanium. It's like that's fine. I'll take it. I have found worse things and better places. Take all that. Uh, I think for the most part we have. We'll have to clear this asteroid field, uh, and I. Think we're kind of got everything kind of done. Um, then at that point we'll we'll go back over there. Uh, I'm, I'll probably sort out after after uh, after I get done recording. So between episodes, uh, I'll get rid of I'll, I'll sort all my ships out and figure out kind of what I want to do. Um, I'm going to probably run around. I want to clear out all this stuff. Uh, and then. Uh, oh, you're just coming right in for me, huh? Let's do this thing. Do that. So no formation. And then go attack. Yeah, mix mix them up. Do do the crazy. All right, what do we got here? Now I would love to see our to get this guy. I, I would really like to get this ship. Um, but does it even have a hatch on it? That's a laser blaster. That's a crew bunk, small thruster, small fuel generator. I don't think um, it doesn't have it doesn't have an airlock in it at all. So since it doesn't have an airlock, like there's nothing I can do. Like I would really like to not blow that crystal off in front of it. Oh, I don't. I think I saved the crystal. Oh, good. All right. Uh, no damage to you. No damage. No damage. No damage. I got out of that with no damage. Nice. So that will uh, hopefully give us a couple of crystals. Or a couple of diamonds. Because those things, those things are spindy. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. Like, I would really like to save that ship and uh, do it, but it doesn't have an airlock, so you can't even capture it. Um, I think it'd be great to have, you know, <laughs> the ability to, to just build a couple of those. I guess you could take, technically, you could take a screenshot and bring it in. Um, so, because you can take a screenshot and bring bring a ship in that. Maybe I'll have to try that. All right, we'll get all this stuff picked up real quick.
We'll let everybody get back in their ship. We're going to go up here, then we'll go over here. Right in their ship. All right. Get this area cleared up. And then what I'll end up having to do is uh, start working on getting uh, everybody the ability to jump out of here because we'll have to, to I have to put uh, jump cores on uh, my ship. I even have uh, jump cores on it. Yeah, well, I think, well, that's just cargo. I think you're just a cargo ship. Who got left out of the ship this time? Jesus. Did you die? I think you died. No, you're not dead. You're, you turn to your ship. What are you guys doing? All right, let's try this again. <laughs> this time with all the people in the ships. Yeah, I, I need to, to kind of upgrade it to get... Uh, right, what, what's over there? Right, you know what? Honestly, I could probably go here. Then I could do the unknown contact on the way out. Because I got I to gotta go that way anyway. So there's no sense in going over there and then coming back and then going back. It's Squirrel. I it, I see. I saw a shiny. It, it was blinking at me. I, I, I got distracted. All right. So, all right. I just got to turn the formation off and then they'll go all right what are you doing uh well that's not a good place to put your cockpit at just just you know for future reference it's not going to help you this time And what are you? You have a standard cannon, a disruptor, and an exploded cockpit. All right, some of the guys are going to try to go up there. That's fine. Oh, they're going to go up there and start taking things apart. All right. I'm sure they'll run out of air. Because they're, they're good at doing that. But yeah, I'm just going to take as many resources as we can. And uh, we're going to go, we'll build a big ship. Uh, I'm going to build a mothership. Um, I'm basically going to... I don't know if... Well, I won't scrap this one to start with. Uh, because I'll, I'll need it intact in case I don't finish it. Uh, and more importantly, uh, if I have it intact, I can get resources also. Uh, but we will start building something big and crazy. Go about halfway. See where all of our guys end up going. Give them a chance if they're trying to get back in to get back into a ship before they run out of oxygen. That is the only bad thing about doing salvage operations with with a bunch of ships like this. Is if you have them all selected, then everybody gets out. Uh, and a lot of these things don't even have cargo spots to even be able to carry stuff. Uh, so it doesn't really matter. 
See anybody hurt? Oh, you are. Oh, that, that, that was... Woo! I don't... I definitely am not going to financially recover from that. Like having the ship spread out like that and, and kind of uh, just go to different locations uh, and spread out, the AI doesn't know what to do with it when, when they're getting swarmed like that. Um, and the uh, as long as you don't, uh, the, whoever's in the back is just going to start ripping the ship apart because they're not made for, people, for, for ships to be behind them. Um, the uh, so n nobody really makes a ship, you know, expecting someone to be behind them, uh, because you don't want to let people behind you. Uh, but when you're getting accosted by a, uh, a swarm of bees, uh, it <laughs> makes it really makes it difficult to defend against it. So, and I may build more of a almost like a station. Like a, a mobile station. Ooh, hyper floor. So the hyper hyper jump beacon. It's good to know where those are. See if that guy stays stays there or if he's gonna run away. This is an asteroid field, so we may actually end up with, with a couple of things there. We'll probably end up with a couple of defensive turrets while we're at it. This may be uh, a uh, defensive structure. And it is a defensive structure. So once again, uh, you'll see it's just got a bunch of cannons on it, but it's got no airlock. Right? So there's crew bunk, crew bunk, crew bunk. It's got two storage boxes for ammunition, basically. And then that's it. Uh, so it makes it really difficult to... Uh, you know, seize those. Uh, and then this thing's got four guns on it, so it can fire on, on both sides. So, but we'll we'll just run in and just start digging through it. And then as soon as you hit the am ammo store, it's it's not not good for it. So anybody anybody injured? You're a little injured. Ooh, you took a couple of couple of shots to the face. Get some copper, iron. Be able to make some plates. Looks like we got a couple more. Uh, Uh, turrets or uh, stations there. Weapons pods. Well, we'll make short work of those. I just wish some of the things you could kind of, you could get them uh, and, and be able to, to, to borrow them. I like borrowing ships. It's it's fantastic. Now you do uh, it, when you borrow a ship like that, or when you uh, when you capture a ship. Uh, you basically, uh, you, you'll lose, like, you don't get all the parts for it. Uh, you get a reduced amount of, of materials from it if you, you know, take it apart or whatever. Uh, so, like, even with the stations, I'll probably, I'll probably lose a lot of that. Uh, but part of the reason I did it was because um, I wanted to, uh, it, the stations had a bunch of iron, or a bunch of uh, yeah, iron in them, uh, a bunch of sulfur, and other things that, that I could sell. Uh, so I, I basically did that. Basically repair them. I put a, a skeleton crew in it, fly it back to where it's easier to sell it. Because that way it's, I, I can move that a lot easier than, than I can, you know, basically load it into my ship and then move it. And then I can do it in the safety of a safety of a station. 
<laughs> all right, so we got all that. Once I've got all that in, then we'll run up here. Oh, we are not going to run up there yet because we've just left the buddy. Oh, that guy. Iron, cranium. Uh, I am looking still always, always on the lookout for carbon. Really? What did you lose now? There's nothing there. And honestly, if I lose these guys, pretty much all I lose is uh, crew. Uh, because most of those ships were salvaged anyway. <laughs> Ooh, that's a slightly larger one. Uh, you probably don't have uh, no airlock on you either, I, I would guess. That is a cooler one, though. Crew quarters, bump. At least that, it's a laser one. Anybody? Oh, you got a little bit of damage. Ah, two plates. Two plates. It take me longer to repair it than it is to find the plates. And chew that guy up. Pick all those parts up. Yeah, so this is basically just a bunch of uh, weapons pods in here. There's some gold, copper. Don't see any carbon. Oh, uh, one of those. All right, shoot that thing in the face. Yeah, so they spread out and come at it from all sides. And it, it, it's just like, ah! Uh, they'll just pick one and just start blasting it. Which is really all I can do. And then we're all lasers, so since we're all lasers, we don't have, there's nothing even to, like, I'm not having to make armor or ammo to replenish or anything like that. So that's, that's nice. Because if we're trying to do ammo, we'd have to be doing ammo, like, every, every single turn. Uh, we are fixing to fill up all of this stuff, though. That is the end of that shenanigan. Well, let's see. can I put another storage box? Yeah, that'll that'll pull up down. We'll get that thing built here real quick. That'll give me at least a little bit more storage. 
Um, and then once I get that, we'll be able to probably get this. And I don't know if we'll be able to pick up the next one or not. Kind of, kind of running out of room to, to score things. Uh, I don't even think I'm going to pick everything else up. Crew and resources, voltage. Oh, you get twenty iron plates on for some reason. Bring those back over. I don't think he had the storage. Yeah, most of these don't have storage on them. Uh, just gun or just bullets there, it looks like, mostly. All right. There is all of that. Oh, uh, you're all, oh, why, why are you mad? Why are you guys out of the ship? All right. All right, let's get us some speed. Fly around that thing so we don't have to fight with it. Since I can't pick it up. Some uranium. All right. Yeah, so I want to go around and basically go at least around through this outer edge and pick up all this stuff. If if I can't use it, I want it sold. Um, I don't like I don't want to leave anything here. Um yeah, yeah, I know, it's fine. Go faster again. I'll go back up and deal with them in a minute. I need to go sell some stuff and make some room in my inventory. And then we'll go back and talk. Get this guy talk. Hail. Uh, it's a bounty. No more points. No more points. No more points. But I got some money. Money's always good. Uh, here, so we'll, we'll unlock the rail gun. Uh, we need to unlock the hyperdrive control room. We'll unlock the bridge, large thruster, huge thruster, huge thruster, and the engine room. Uh, I'm moving walkways, large reactors, uh, factory, factory, tractor emitter. Hyperdrive beacon. That would be good. Let's make one. Let's do that. Uh, and the explosive charge. Uh, so basically, I'm just going to, I I just buy it. Uh, don't have to deal with it. Don't have to worry about it. Uh, let's see. So I don't have, let's see. Yeah, definitely sell the ammo. Get that out of my inventory. Uh, let's sell the iron plates and then initiate trade. Now, I wonder, I know my guys will start carrying stuff out, and then they'll come start coming to get stuff. I was wondering if the other ships would start helping, but I don't. I guess not. And let's find the effigy. We'll have him help you. We'll have you sell. We'll have you sell your plates, too. Eventually, when you figure it out. So yeah, so you just it just had it has that one little cargo thing. Uh, I don't even know why it has a cargo thing other than just maybe maybe to carry a little bit of cargo. 
Maybe just to carry a little bit of repair stuff. All right, let's get all this stuff sold. Because they got a lot of plates to pull out and a lot of ammo to pull out. I probably should just not pick up ammo, but I always forget to filter my my looting. Uh, so I end up picking up everything. So much garbage. But it's nice to be able to sell it, right? Because that's, you know, 30,000 credits that I wouldn't have had. Uh, and by the time it gets done, like, we, we all spent, like, I think we we'll spent, like, 40 or 60,000. Uh, and we'll get most of the money back. Uh, so that way, once we get done, we basically have everything everything researched now. Uh, so we bought all the different uh, stuff to be able to build whatever we want. Uh, All right, now we're all good there. Go ahead, highlight everybody. And then we're going to go back over. There. We're going to go find our friend. We're going to crank it up to eight. And then once it comes into range and shows up on radar, I'll drop us back to one, which is very nice of it. Usually, sometimes it's a really a pain in the butt when it does it. There it goes. All right, go kill that thing. I'm tired of I'm tired of it going mark, mark, at me. Get us some speed. Should get uh, here soon. Should be able to see what it is. Which one is it? Oh, it's that one. Oh, there you go. We'll see it again in a second. It'll be fine. It's fine. Everybody shoot that. Oh, good. Crash into each other. That helped. All right. Go ahead, destroy that thing for me. You don't need any repairs. You need some repairs. Go ahead and repair all of that. Uh, FPG's okay. The guy's okay. I, I, all the guys are okay. Oh, the FPG, I think, is going to go grab the parts it needs to repair this ship. All right, so we got all that stuff done. Now that's just an asteroid field now. I think for the most part. Let's see. I'm going to do you. Go there. You go there. So you tell that station that'd be great. Uh, what? Uh, we're not doing deliveries. Uh, we'll accept the explore. We'll accept the explore. We'll accept the explore. I'll accept all of those. I don't know why you keep trying to help me. All right. So do I have? Uh, it didn't give me any more location. Uh, 
I didn't tell me anywhere else to go. I don't know what else I'm missing. I, I don't understand what I'm missing for those explore things. So I'll have to, I'll have to let go. Oh, I think I just need to go to the stations to get them. Maybe. So I think I just need to go to the different stations to actually get uh, my the, get the items. I so actually, I'm gonna have this guy instead go down there. So all that stuff should be almost done. We we'll get all that stuff picked up. Pick. Take our fleet, cruise back down to here. And then uh, the next trick is going to be, like, these guys are slow uh, because I think this guy's got, like, two crew. There's, like, one guy to fly it and the other guy to stuff fuel into, into the engines. That's all I got. Uh, this one's got uh, very similar. There's a guy to fly it and a guy to stick fuel in. That's about it. Get the cut from in. And this one, like, I grabbed it. It looks kind of cool, but uh, I don't know. I, I had to kick, turn off all the weapons, uh, or all the, the weapons, because with all the weapons, they uh, they were trying to uh, they were trying to man all the guns instead of fuel the engines, and it wouldn't go anywhere. Um... Yeah, go ahead and do that. That's fine. I guess this wasn't a, a base I needed to go to. Talk to this guy. Uh, so we clear the asteroid field. No points there. Uh, floor. No points. Points. No points. So basically, all we we have from that is we'll we'll get everybody going back up there. Get you going back up there. Oh, you you didn't like that. How are you so far away? Now it's time eight. Jeez. All right. I don't see a, a thing. Maybe I just didn't transfer all the, the equipment or something. No, you're out of guns. You got two people on board. I thought that. I think that's all you had. Oh well. All right, let's get this guy here. See if this guy's got any quest turn in. Uh, no, we don't want to start killing other people. Okay, so where am I supposed to turn that in at? Send you back there. You should be a little bit faster.
Uh, that's fine. You're outside the red line. You should be all right. All right, let's do this. Just make sure that the... Yeah, we're good there. Not there either. All right, let's get some speed. Oh, Jesus, I'm at 50 freaking minutes. <laughs> all right. Well, we, we got it cleared out. Uh, we'll get everybody moved back up there. Uh, I'll get all my ships kind of figured out here in a little bit. And uh, next time, we'll uh, hopefully have a more streamlined adventure, and uh, we will go from there. But with that, hopefully you all are having a good time, and we will see you all soon.